Hello Capricorn, welcome to this reading. My name is Mia and we are going to have a look at general energies for career, money and finance for the next two months, for the April and May 2022. I hope you're doing well. Just keep in mind this is a general reading. So take the messages that resonate with you and leave the rest. And if you're new to this channel, please consider subscribing as I do daily, weekly and monthly readings. And if this is your sun sign, have you checked out your moon and rising sign for more information? Okay. I'm going to take three cards from the back and put them on the side for clarification later. All right. So, Capricorn, what do we have? Page of Pentacles at the right in the middle here for April. So page of pentacles is a person or a situation can that can deliver. Okay, that could be a message regarding a new um, contracts or new opportunities coming in. But it as well is a page of pentacles talks about eager to start something new. You are so ready. You've been waiting for it. You're past the idea and you're like, you know what? My new working boots are on. I'm ready to go for it. And it's just not just a dream anymore. It's not just a talking about it. But this is something you want to go and do it. And you are ready. You're super, super ready. As we have Chariot right here. And Chariot talks about um, delivering. Okay. It's kind of manifestational card. And it talks about the free will. You know, whatever we are doing. And we make choices. And we live with them. But we go for it. We kind of march ahead with the force of inner inner strength. And though we have the four swords next to it, it says it could be that we don't know, I don't know what happened before, okay? But you might be at the point where you needed some time out. You needed the balance, you needed the sleep. You needed a good night's rest. And as soon as you do that, you're already up and go. And the sleep is needed. The balance is needed. You know, because we can't just work 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 and otherwise we Kind of work and burn out, okay? It's not just all about money, but it is about money. But once we are doing it, once we are working it, we need to look after ourselves as well. Our mind and our body. And that is important to keep in mind. We have the judgment here. So judgment talks about whatever decisions you make, what made you to make them? Was it you going to do something for in spite for someone or whatever the situation is and this is a new opportunity that is right next to it so it is just kind of asking me why you want to do this just to ask yourself is your intentions clear because if it's not the judgment day is going to come okay what goes around comes around you know that all it's just that you are clear that whatever you want to start, something new, and go for it, is not the spite of something and someone. Just a message, just a gentle message, okay? And five of cups. So, there might have been so upset before, okay? And don't we all get sometimes like that? But this card asks to be forgiving and look at the bright side. Because the bright side there is, you know? Three cups spilt, two cups still there. The opportunities are still flowing. Look at the river right there. And maybe you don't see it. Maybe you are ready to go ahead. And it's not exactly working out how you want. There could be some, some breaks pulled. So it could be that there could be some sort of disruption happening. And because it doesn't go exactly how you want, you feel like, what's the point? I'm not going to do it. And, well, you can do so anytime. That's your free will, okay, Capricorn. But we have the death card. So you might cry for two minutes over those three spilled cups. But you're going to come to the realization what is best for you. What is the best way to take and definitely in the May, we have the death card next to the Ten of Cups. So it is like 
you're gonna nearly like transform yourself <laughs> it literally feels like you're gonna transform it could be that even you are removing yourself from the situation at work or whatever you wanted to go maybe it didn't work out or didn't work out exactly how you wanted it and you might regroup and you're like you know what okay so what do i have shall i start something completely new or is there something i can work with and th there's that seem that there is something good that you could work with on these energies here don't just leave them and dump, dump them because it didn't fit you on the first um site and you're gonna make the right decision because we have ten of cups here followed by three of pentacles temperance it's like your transformation is kind of like you like being a new person maybe you do have that good night's sleep and you wake up next morning you're like wow i know what to do i'm gonna take there is another 10 cups here and you work on them and you are successful and you become even more successful because you are becoming a master of what you do you're literally like taking it could be that you are taking a new role and and whatever you do is it a company or even at your own business do you become if you are let's say you were maybe doing just for making pancakes just for a restaurant and suddenly you decided maybe okay i'm gonna start to deliver it is some it could be the same area but it's just a little, little twist it's kind of like being good at something and become a teacher of it you're gonna sh show others people you might actually spreading the word of how to become master of things because temperance is here and temperance talks about balance so your balance is definitely needed capricorn you know you could just work 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 the work-life balance is here again you know the physical mental and spiritual even though it's ca career and finances but you it's you your body it's your mind but this is good as well it's kind of things are flowing in things are taking the right speed they're really flowing really nicely it feels like there's a lovely flow of energy going now here with followed by queen of cups lovely it kind of feels that whatever you're gonna take the choice on the financial the the career it's gonna feel really stable really stable you're gonna be really content it feels like you you kind of feel like you achieved really lovely um time it's like your playground you're gonna feel you right so two of cups hangman and five of swords right so two of cups it could be that you might find yourself that you there is something within you that you didn't discover and together with the death card you kind of wow i didn't see that in myself you might discover that there is part of you that um was prepared to drop the negative side drop that kind of victim and why me side and you turned around and said you know what i'm gonna go for it i'm victorious and i'm gonna let go i'm gonna lo let go of my ego i'm gonna let go of that everything has to go exactly the way it is and once you do so things are happening and on the way maybe some s things may said because this card talks about the reasons we do is the clear clear intentions because um if we kind of playing dirty it might come back dirty as we have the judgment card as well our intentions need to be clear definitely i'm quickly gonna clarify yeah hierophant you you know the higher energies you know universe and the whole world is watching you even you think you're not and you don't maybe you don't care but for you you need to want to feel good when you make the decision when you make this new transformation wow right capricorn i'm gonna leave you in these energies here thanks for being here and i'll see you next reading bye